Alrighty, g'day guys, welcome to another game of Legion TD on Lil. Ward Spear Militia, uh, pretty sure I just always play that. Check my team's roles in case, but... So it's Aqua with, uh... Not the best adds, rerolls, Aqua Disciple with Exact Start. I mean, I'm 100% playing this, it's super strong. Ah, uh, 1 to 10. Uh, it's week on three. Is week on three. Uh, depending how I play it, of course. Okay, starting this way, fair enough. I mean, it's definitely the egg sack is super good. So it's very understandable to want to keep that. Mouth, don't have the best adds. We can go like triple corrupted ant next level. Then we can mix with like Maverick, Alchemist, or Veteran going forwards. I do not want to have to cover three. That is not what I want to have to do. We're also probably not going to have four gold for three. Which means no three zero clockwork if I wanted to go that route. I could stay one zero. I could. Is it reasonable? Well, got Aqua Disciple. Do I just do it? I mean... We're not good on two except for me, he's not pushing. But I don't think that changes that much. I actually think it's quite reasonable for me to just stay. We're pretty fast. Hmm. I'm gonna do it, but I'm not sure it's correct. So, Militia upgraded 95 plus 15, 110 gold, means I need 167 in total, right? Because I get 147. Hang on, I need 110 gold. So I need 160 gold in total to do a wisp. At the moment, I okay, can't, so I'm 4 gold off doing a wisp. Yeah, I'm 4 gold off doing a wisp. Okay, cool. Um, I'm just going to stay 1-0 for it then. I don't want to mix with dragon, and that doesn't make a difference. If we 3, though, that changes things. Okay. Of course, I have to actually get the uh, verb in income, though. Which may not happen. Unlucky. Not quite. Do you think I get an armor, or do I just get a spear? Well, we just do two more peasants. I know I'm going to keep overbuilding, so... I don't like being 1-0 here, but doesn't feel good. Uh, yeah, they can do that if they want. It doesn't really stress me out. I'm going to go th three spear militia, I guess. It's more just I'm pretty bad on three. If I actually don't get this double militia and this double militia is still bad on three, right? That's the thing. This is still bad on three. Right. So we'll see how they go. Okay, we'll get a scout, so that's nice. Should be able to determine if they did king. It's going to be two lanes leaking, I believe. You know what they have. Okay, that's just king. 
It's green, X Sprite NG, pink, privateer. And then three health bottle. Okay. Okay, what's the likelihood that they send here? It's almost nothing. How bad are we here? Completely fine. Hmm. It's, it's a bit hard with him. Because I think the veterans are not the best placement. Can be fine if he gets uh, relatively lucky on the aggro, but I think the prisoner will drag the creeps to the wall and then the veteran will be uh, healthy when the mouths are dead. Okay. Really wants to feed me. So I gotta make sure I don't overpush, but I already haven't. Uh, triple spear militia is a lot. And they're really trying to feed me here. I'm not sure how I feel about that. Hmm. Interesting. So I'm always doing that. He wants me Hades on 6. Yeah, that's true, actually. That's true, that's true. I wonder if it was better to do the armor on this outside one, since I didn't think about the peasants dragging the creeps. Which is totally fine when they're all melee, uh, but it's pretty bad to lose this one, yeah. I didn't think about the peasants dragging the creeps around, so that's not great. But team's not leaking so much. Also, the fastest leaks by far are from Bond, and they're all damaged, so that's really good. Um, oh yeah, it's gonna fucking auto wave, oh, which maybe, which is scary. No, uh, no, it shouldn't yet, actually. Okay, we'll be good. I actually have nice focus. Yeah, I have nice focus. Okay. Wow, I get fed here. Yeah. Okay. Guess that was pretty fine, then. Right, let's just grab another cloth at this point, right? You can go double militia, double armor with a farm upgrade. So my job isn't to send anything this game, it's to hold 710, which is obviously extremely easy now. In fairness, I don't actually think I needed any feed to do that, but it's fine. Because so normally the build looks something like this, except it's odd with like 5 to 6 spears, instead of Hades with 4. But let's see, so I need 280, so 270 gold. I don't have that at the moment, but he's mid, but small, he's leaking, he's leaking. So, should be fine to do that. So, I need a farm. So, see how much time there is.
I think I can do spirit well um right. Or oh, hammer well brother. Hey, nice like. Um, I was totally fine with him going small mid as well. So I'm just going to do the whelp here. Because I want to make sure I get a farm. I'm going to show you 8, 16, 24, 32. Yeah, I'll get it. Okay. I'll get it for sure. But I don't want to have to do the farm upgrade super late because farm obviously takes 8 seconds to upgrade and then these take some time to upgrade before I can actually select to put the spear. So if I do the hermit before income, right, then I would hit 80 wood at 8 seconds and I might just be able to upgrade these two militia but I wouldn't get spears on them. That would be called TK, uh, which it would be. So we don't do that. Anyway, obviously I go mid here because I have 1345 value. There's like actually just no way it doesn't happen. Uh, looks like none of my spears get sniped as well, which is obviously preferable. So yeah, that's pretty good. Well, this one gets a little... No, never mind. That was a imp? Imp. I lose the Hades, but that's fine. That's what he's there for. Okay. Yeah, not, not the best Diabolic in the world, but you know what? As long as he spawns in front like this, he should still tank a bit, and that will be fine. Or just not tank at all. Well, whatever. Fuck you, Diabolic. It's fine. They don't have Immolation, so this is completely reasonable trade. How much for attack? Good. Glad we've got some attack. Okay, yeah, that's stomp. It's minus one, I believe. Pretty good that they don't have any mids. Obviously, I go mid, but that's like on my team feeding me excessively. Once again, I'm pretty confident I can like carry this game without the feed, but I mean, fuck it if you're going to give it to me. Uh, it's minus two coming. And they're going to lose a third. Looks like we also lose three. Shouldn't lose four with this shockwave here though. Yeah, they lose three. And we'll have shockwave before we heal again. This is minus three. Are we fine here? Yeah, we're fine. Uh, if if I thought we weren't, then I would do a regen, but I would rather just fast lumberjack. Okay, go 7-2, second Hades. Uh, obviously, because my team leaked 5-6. Um... Obviously, because my team liked 5-6 uh, to feed me, that means the bounties are going to be, like, lower than average here. So I don't want to, like, greet it with a uh, 7-3. And I don't really want to stay, like, 7-1. But yeah, you can just drop the lot and... 
can just drop the lot and reroll. Use the free. Leaking here is actually quite good for us, I think. I think it's fine. But, okay. I mean, if we're just aiming to end the game on dead, then it's fine to stay as well. We got like full melee ranges with some turrets for, um. Oh, and he has, um. What do you call him? He has, uh, Avnos that he can upgrade as well. So, yeah, he's actually, like, reasonable at doing damage. It's not a great 10 holder per se, but. Pretty reasonable at doing damage. Uh, Dragonhawk on pink. That's Griffin on uh, Privateer, the other two lanes leaked. Okay. Okay. So thinking about my... What do I, what do I need to do? I need to drop one Lord and one tier one. And reroll. Okay, yep, I can do that. Uh, good roll at this point in the game. Definitely a good roll. Bit awkward since you can't quite afford a talk. Sold one too many of those tier ones, so I didn't need to sell as many. But. It's fine. If he gets a talk for 10, that's good. Does he? Um, probably. Thanks. I mean, obviously it's for me, right? But, so thanks. Anyway, I'm saving here in case I get something better than second Hades, which is unlikely, but it is definitely free roll time. Actually, that may not be true. I wanted well, right? That actually may not be true. Um, thinking about it, this game's like probably 12 to 14. Uh, it's kind of fat actually. Maybe that's not true. Look, I'll just see how much gold I have. Realistically, if I'm like barely over 650, then I'm in. There's nothing I'm going to want more than two Hades. Like, thinking about it realistically, what do I prefer than a second Hades? I think, like, actually almost nothing. Probably actually almost nothing. I mean, here's a question. Would I rather have a Hydra? I think actually no. I think no. The Hades on orange, but he leaked, like, every level of this game, and he has Engineer ads, so I think it's not that scary. It might actually be a little bit scary, but I feel like it's not that scary. And yeah, I mean, I afford Hades blocker. Like, yeah, we're happy. Gonna build a little further over. Still here. No, I like. I liked it where it was a bit more. Do it here. Yeah, okay. Leave it there. Cool. Uh, yep. That'll be the build. I'm going to save. My team wants to send for, they can all send for pretty easily. Uh, but I want to save just to make sure I can uh, jack. Do you get a talk? No. Okay. Guess he couldn't afford it. Send spawn. Not the biggest send though, so I expect to be completely fine. Also, like, in terms of where the bosses are, I'm pretty happy. Just kill the spawn fairly quickly. So I'm gonna kill this boss before it snipes my Hades, which is awesome. Yes. Okay, that's really good then. Oh, you got Pudge as well? Uh, kind of unlucky, because maybe it stuffs him, but I mean... I'm pretty fucking happy I don't have to deal with it, so there's that. Uh, yeah, everyone on my team killed a boss, that's actually really awesome. Unfortunately, you get stuck 7-4 because of the Pudge, but I mean, 
you know, what can you do? We may not be king. Yeah. I should respawn. Should be able to double resign. Yeah, okay. Well, guaranteed double resign, actually. Because they just instantly did it. Uh, pretty sure I ate everything. Is that correct? Hmm. Nice wife. Okay. Nope. Hades doesn't want to focus this one, so we like two bosses. Okay, that's fine. Uh, I'll stay 7-4. They're going to lose the 4th heal, I think. Maybe not, actually. Hmm, it's close. They have that stomp left. Yeah, I think it's gone for them. Wow. The Bowman hero. Fuck yes, Legolas. It's definitely a Legolas gap there. Um, I think I can just... do this. I think I can just go mid every level. I think I keep this. Yeah, I think I just keep it. Rather than go full Dark Priest with two Hades. Because, like, I'm a little bit scared of a 14. Maybe I'm meant to just full Dark Priest anyway, though. Hmm. I'm not sure. So th 3 Hades is better, um, 13, 14, and 2 Hades is better, 15. Lose the arena, not overly surprising, but a bit unfortunate. I sold those two peasants I put down, right? I think I did. I hope I did. Yeah, was a bit. Double talk, I guess, and they don't have any, like, mass units, so they end up blowing up pretty quick. And it is true, we have double aqua, which is generally quite bad arena. Okay, looking at the lanes. 7-7 seven, seven EA. Um, Hades. Time stealer. Min is pretty weak. So this lane has double griffin. I mean, that's their only relevant line, with Tox Sprite, actually. They're the two relevant lines this game. Since we full banked, we can probably kill them 14, actually. I think it was correct to do this third Hades. They look quite killable 14, and we're not, like, particularly safe 14. But for me, it's, like, might mid 14. Clear. Leak fairly hard. Leak fairly hard. That's, like, where my head is at for their lanes on 14. And he has 1300 wood. He has 1100 wood with 7.4. He has 1200 wood, 7.6. And I've got 1000 wood. So our lumber is like completely reasonable considering we're standing against zero heals in honestly somewhat of a weak game. So while I absolutely don't think we have to go 14, I think it is a reasonable option for us. And that also um, makes just building versus like 14, I guess even like 14, 17 with this is that a bit better of an upside.
But yeah, just Hades for a bit. So they kinged on 10 to send as much as they didn't get 25 um, attack and 20 HP. Eleven crimps. It's it looked like he full built basically. So that um, that archer can absolutely hold uh, twelve thirteen if he wants to. I think Bond's holding here. Uh, this disciple tanked five hundred HP and survived. Which is insane. Then Mutant is like, Mutant is pretty good on 12. I think people underrate Mutant on 12. Is there a leak? There is no leak. Do we want that? Okay. Um, so no league no league twelve makes this third head is pretty terrible actually. I think you definitely could hold with egg. I mean, I, I'm always building Dark Breasts. I shouldn't save gold here. Job done. Not sure how I feel about my uh, hold on 15, though. With three Hades, I'm actually a bit concerned I might just leak. Uh, because of the third Hades. I also might just kill the Fire Lord in like half a second and then hold, so you know, there's that. That slow kill was maybe orange. I think it's actually pretty good he holds uh, as well, by the way. Like, his lane is very relevant. Uh, talk like Ice Troll, Aqua. It's a good lane. I really appreciate this feed here, actually. Do you think I go Dark Priest here? I think I do. Hmm, I think i do that one for sure, and then this one. Because what I'm trying to get, which you would have probably seen in a few Dark Priest games, is I want to get the Dark Priest's forwards in range of the Krakens, because that's when they snipe the Krakens. They don't, they're not going to snipe the Krakens if they're like fucking sitting here attacking centaurs here. they got to be here, where the Krakens are here, sort of thing. Uh, that's the idea behind that placement. 362 gold. Man, it's just never gonna be enough, right? Never gonna get double dark priest. Okay. I guess I'll take the income then. Yeah, that makes sense. Bond hasn't done a second Kraken yet, so he's not reaching. 
Uh, carry. Carry, okay, can. I guess I 50 roll. I guess so. So sad. I mean, it's actually just doesn't do anything. It actually just doesn't do anything. Also, I'm pretty sure this is better. It's not worth a Dark Priest, I don't think. It might be, but I don't think it is. Uh, we have five Behemoths. Five Behemoths is actually fine, by the way. Okay, I get one Kraken and a Warlock. Two Kraken, two Kraken, two Kraken. I'm super happy about one Kraken because I'm not that confident in my hold. With three Hades and uh, four, only four Dark Priests. Two Hades, six Dark Priests, I start to feel pretty good. But in the end, I have a lot of value. I snipe the Behemoth and the Send is low. So these let me. these factors let me go mid. Dark Priest actually gets sniped, which is a bit weird considering where it is, but... It's okay, I go mid, it's not an amazing mid, but they have zero heals, so just one mid should be a pretty good difference maker. How much king do we have? Not that much. Pushing is not good. It's always automatic to start the push, nothing wrong with that. And then you start the push and assess whether it's allowed or if it's illegal. There's two lanes leaking there, but there's definitely three lanes. Uh, they have a mid as well because your old helicopter on the Griffin, but that's okay. I get double resummon, which will actually slow this down a lot. Uh, it'll like stack everything up, but it does slow it down. So we should be winning this. Yeah, they have zero heals, we have one heal. We die pretty slowly. No warlocks. Obviously only three fire lords. I think if we were even heals, we lose. Yeah, if we were even heals, we lose. But it's fine. Because we're not even heals, so we have one more. Anyway, feels good, man. Cheers very much for watching, guys. Appreciate it. Like, subscribe, all of that. And I'll catch you in the next one. Cheers.